Hey there, I'm John Siskovich. I'm out on the brewery and the farm today, and we're gonna go into the tasting room to my farm store to show you one of the ways I market my chicken to my customers. It's something that I've used for a couple years now, and it's been fairly effective, and I've got to watch people interact with it. Let's, uh, let's head on inside. Can't go anywhere without the dog. So right in the beginning, we have a freezer, and it's got chicken inside, and it's got pork inside. And on top of it, I have all the details about my chicken, uh, everything included. It's frozen, the giblets are on the inside, it's packed with nutritious goodness. I split them in uh, half, so I sell the holes in the half. You get $6 per pound, average four pounds, $6 uh, per pound on split chickens, average about two pounds. Now, <clears throat> the one that I wanted to point out was one chicken equals four meals. You get a roast chicken, chicken tacos, chicken salad, chicken stock. Now, when you're paying $6 a pound per chicken, you wanna know that you're getting enough uh, bang for your buck and that it's not just a $24 bird for one meal. So I highlighted the fact, and I did all these illustrations myself, I uh, wanted to highlight the fact that you're gonna get more than one meal out of each chicken. And that is a big point in the conversation that I have with people when I'm at the farmer's market, when I'm in the farm store, when I'm giving a farm tour, basically anytime I'm talking to somebody and they're saying, well, your chicken's a little pricey. And I'm like, yeah, well, it's raised on pasture, it's organic, it's non-GMO, my feed prices cost a lot. And I'm unapologetic about what the price is because you're not gonna just buy a chicken and then throw out the leftovers. You're gonna have meals possibly for the week or feed a large family. And it is more expensive to feed a large family. Now, uh, I have sheets like this uh, all over my farm, in the tasting room, out on uh, some of my chicken equipment. And I have this video series where I'm highlighting some of these things in actual use cases. If you want your own copies of these, well, I have this uh, marketing pasture poultry uh, pasture poultry packet number two and if we flip in there's tabs on philosophy relationship strategy tools and then at the end is marketing <clears throat> and there's over 50 pages of these infographics things that I've used throughout the years and on page 213 of this book is that graphic that I have on my freezer so you can print it out for yourself and then uh, begin marketing and selling more chickens today now because there are 50 more sheets I'm not gonna go through all of them but let's just say I picked out a few that I'm gonna be highlighting on this week's video series. Hope you stick around and join. If you don't buy the book, that's fine. It's not the point of these videos. The point of these videos is to show you what tools I use, how I use them, and how my customers interact with them. I hope you have an awesome day. I hope your life is exciting right now in a good way. And until next time, I will see you out in the field.